Okay, so hi there, and uh, just something a little bit different today. Um, so I use Sky Demon in the aircraft for flying, as you'll probably see of some of the maps and uh, layovers I started to do now. Um, but what's really exciting is that if you use flight simulators as well as real world flying, which I do, um, in this case I use X Pain 11, then you can actually configure Sky Demon to work with X Pain 11. So what that means is when you're flying from home um, in the simulator, you can use your iPad exactly the same way as if you would in real life, which is really handy. Um, so there's a couple of things we need to do. Firstly, just going to start in X-Plane. And um, one of the first things we're going to do is just enable um, outputs from uh, X-Plane to any mapping devices, really. So Skydeam is one of them, but obviously you've got Four Flight and, and various other things as well. So first thing we do is in X-Plane, we go to the settings um, options and once we're um, in the settings there there's an option to uh, enable outputs um, to uh, anything on your network really and, and for that reason when you go settings you'll see those options under the network tab um, as we're, we're seeing here so the important one for us is the one that's called broadcast to all mapping apps on the network or that's certainly the one i use um, there's a bunch of other things here as well which which i'm sure you can explore um, so as long as that one's ticked broadcast to all mapping apps then sky Demon can pick it up um, but so could four flight if you happen to use that or any other uh, mapping uh, software uh, that you've got available but importantly it's on the same network so when I'm at home explain my iPad running on the same network here um, but that will enable it okay and, it, and it's really clever it just works which is good to know um, you know they've obviously thought about this or given it some thought so make sure that options ticked um, I'll go done and then what I need to do is a couple of things on the or, or one important thing actually on the iPad so we'll uh, pick it up there in, in a second Okay, so back into Sky Demon, what we need to do is we need to go to Sky Demon settings now. So I've already put in a route, as you'll see. Then we go third party devices, and what this will do is it will enable X Plane as a source of uh, location information, if you like. So rather than using the location services, um, as in the GPS, we're going to use X Plane, and this is just enabling it. So you see it was already enabled there, just re enabled it uh, just for the purposes of this. That's pretty much it for settings, okay, because obviously we've done a lot of work in X Plane. So, all we're going to do now, when we're ready to fly, uh, we'll just literally go to Go Flying as we would normally um, in the plane. Um, however, rather than clicking on location services as we would in real life, we'll put use X Plane because uh, that option is available now. And what you'll see it will do, it will look for X Plane. It's found it straight away because uh, I've got it running, as you can see, on the right hand side. And there we are, we're on the apron, um, we're ready to go, um, as we would be again in, in real life, just comparing it to that. Um, I'm not going to go through Sky Demon and what will happen from here, but if we were to fly now, uh, Sky Demon would react in exactly the same way, track our progress um, as you would expect. Okay, so I hope that was useful, just a, a brief video there, and we'll see you next time.